Get Ready With Me to go to the Juicy Scoop podcast with Heather McDonald. And I just saw that she did a Get Ready With Me video. I thought I could do a Get Ready With Me video. I'm drinking my coffee bean. I know people hate on this, but it's not trash. I just have the cold brew. Okay, I've got old hair from yesterday that I'm just gonna touch up and a full face to do. Show you the current bathroom situation. Good lighting, but I will be doing lashes today. Do not let me forget the lashes. We're using the wand to curl the hair. Clean little face here. I'm truly trying to do my makeup in 25 minutes. We have my Tula stick. I could put this everywhere. I love it. It lightens up the foss. Now I know this is tan look super glow, but it's actually the Mario Badesco toner. Just use that as a travel. I love a tan look, super glow. And I also love Mario Badesco toner. Best toner, best smelling toner, best feeling toner. And it comes in a massive bottle. First thing I do is eyes. I use my finger for my base. Beauty Beauty, the nude. I do nude colors first. Really just patting my eye in there and packing it on. And then I take the light color and I put it right underneath the brow. The lighting in this bathroom is not ideal. Like it's good, but it's not everywhere. I'm gonna go with a little bit of a darker brown. This is where you say to yourself, trust the process. Okay, because it's gonna be all over your eyes. This is why I do my eye makeup first. I know people have a method. Too Faced. This is an old AF palette. All you gotta do is just get it all over your face and then clean it up later, okay? Look at me using a brush. Get into the crease a little bit. I'm using House Labs. This is the highlighter, but I'm putting a little bit on my eye because I don't have enough shimmer and I want it to be a little bit more shimmery. Tried some Shimsky. Then I'm gonna go back over it to create the smoky eye, but even darker brown black. Do my lower lid with a little bit of dark. Back to our nude palette. Take the light one. Dark blue, lower line, because I do have blue in my shirt. Do. Uh oh, mascara. To prepare for today, I checked out most recent stories, everything from the Golden Globes, but that's kind of old news already. I've also watched Salt Lake City, The Reunion, part one. Now, let me check what time it is, because it feels like it's, it's late. Eyes, lips, face, brow gel. I'm not doing anything too crazy. I always brush them up and then I do a little side sweep. Then I just let that set, I let that drop. Based hangover cure. I kind of use this as a little bit of a primer. And this is the foundation. Generously putting that all over. My favorite foundation brush. L'Oreal Lumi Glotion, the Holy Grail. I don't know who started this. I understand. It's very luminous. The way my nose is so shiny right now, it's not really doing any favors. Under eye concealer, a little bit up here. Okay, just gonna blend, blend, blend. Yes, I am rushing. Now is the time that I tell you guys that I forgot my bronzing liquid, which I would usually put right here and right here. So I have to go hard on my just bronzer palette, which is dry. I'm also being quiet because I'm in a hotel and the lady is right there next to me. This is just a plumping liquid, but I put this on when I wait for it to plump up. You. I'm just gonna go in with a little eyeliner. Ah. Reset the hair real quick. And then of course I'm using the Kenra hairspray, best smelling hairspray in the mo effing game, okay? Move it up and down. You're just gonna give a little bit of that. Bam. The angle in which, ow, just burned my forehead. Finishing powder, L'Oreal Mercier, the best, the best. A little bit more blush. And then I'm going to finish the brows. 